I lost my train of thought. Welcome to an extra spooky episode of the what? <coughs> oh, oh. <coughs> Welcome to Why Are They Not Fat? The corner of the internet where we look at casting choices in Broadway musicals and ask the question, okay, but how come those ones are fat though? I'm your host, Chelsea Jane Bray. I can roll down a hill faster than you'd think, and then tap dance my way to the hospital. I'm a dancer first. Why are they not fat? This is the spooky origin story of the internalized fat phobia of Disney adults. So take a break from planning your Magic Kingdom wedding, and let's talk about fat Disney fans. Or as I called it growing up, the only Halloween costumes that fit me. I have a confession to make. I I haven't watched any of the most recent Disney movies, you know, like Lupa or Soul or Wally -E or anything like this. As far as I understand, they're sort of movies with a one word name where the villain is just like an abstract concept. Identity, grief, climate change. <laughs> love for example hungry for the power of a thin woman and she like eats those shrimps weird and then um she uses those clams for like lipstick well angel fish the solution to your problem is simple and i'm not 100 percent sure that that's not supposed to be blood or hades chomping at the bit of jealousy. Also eating slugs weird. Why do Disney characters always eat like worm things in like a weird way? Food for thought. <laughs> I did a pun. <laughs> I didn't even mean to. I'm very funny. Governor Ratcliffe from Pocahontas. The fat genocidal colonizer. He's terrifying. Also, he's absolutely what I picture when people say their family came over on the Mayflower. Professor Radigan from The Great Mouse Detective. Okay. I do have sympathy for him. Is he a criminal mastermind? Yeah, sure. Does he like openly admit to enjoying being wicked and immoral? Yes, okay, but remember that he doesn't like being called Rat and that he insists on being called Big Mouse instead. Sounds like someone needs to do a little school searching and realize that he is more than what society labels him. Rat doesn't have to have a judgment value attached to it. It's just a description. Queen of Hearts. She's what you get. I imagine if you put a room full of male writers together and told them to write Henry VIII as a woman. Please feel free to sound off in the comments about the historical accuracy of that statement. If previous videos have taught us anything, I know how y'all are horny for history. Disney, like, you know, everybody, likes to use size juxtaposition to emphasize character foils. In these examples, the fat villains are imposing, towering figures over the hero. But that's of course just if they're tall fats. If they're short fat villains, then they're just stupid. Like uh, Gaston and LeFou, Captain Hook and Smee, Jafar and Iago. I know Iago's a parrot, but you can't tell me that bird's not juicy. I recognize that these characteristics are not unique to fat villains, so y'all can take your little fingies off the keyboard. I have also seen Emperor's New Groove, or Robin Hood, or 101 Dalmatians. The difference is that the fat characters never get to be the heroes. Thin folks come in all ranges of morality, but fat folks are always stinky, poopy, meanie buttheads. So this Halloween, while you're struggling to find plus size options at Party City, why don't you think about going as the hero, even if you're fat and they for sure are not. Me personally, I'm going as Minnie Mouse. She's not a rat, she's a big mouse. Thanks for watching. And remember this trick or treat season, the fat kids are just as entitled to the Halloween candy as the thin kids. So when they come to your door, you don't need to make a comment. Bye bye <laughs> I don't know what Minnie Mouse does. Oh, maybe she just goes, oh, Mickey. I don't think I've ever seen a movie with her in it. Oh, no. Is she in a Goofy movie? I thought the mice were in that. I thought the mice were in all of them. Why are they not fat? Thanks for watching. We 
really appreciate it. Why don't you click some buttons you could like or subscribe?